Hey friends, welcome to my channel and today in this video I am going to show you how to install dual boot operating system Windows 10 and the latest version of Ubuntu. So let's get started. And here what I have, I have one pre-installed operating system, a pre-installed virtual machine. I have installed Windows 10 on that virtual machine with the RAM 4GB. If you want to verify, here is my machine. I have installed Windows 10 on this machine for properties you can see 4GB RAM Windows 10 Enterprise Edition so I am going to close it close it so let's do the installation I have pre I have downloaded the Ubuntu 16.04.1 desktop operating system ISO MS from Ubuntu website and now I am going to do one thing if you check now and verify I have a, s a disk on my machine which is 120 uh, around 126 GB and I'm going to take uh, some sep separate part of this disk so disk management and from here connecting to virtual machine so we have 127 GB disk 0 and I'm going to shrink some space from this volume so right button and click on shrink so I'm going to like shrink of around 50 GB space from C drive after this you can see we have C drive of Windows OS which is OS disk is now 75 around 75 GB left and we have unallocated space around 50 GB so I'm going to use the uh, I'm going to use this 50 GB partition to install uh, install the Ubuntu operating system and for swap file as well as so it's done and now I'm going to mount my installation media for Ubuntu you can say use ISO image go here I'm in Bavi, ISO, Linux and Ubuntu 16.4.0 so I'm going to install the desktop version of Ubuntu operating system right now so browse it open so here you can see media is mounted and what I'm, I'm going to do I'm going to like restart this machine and we need to change the boot order from BIOS like we, ne we need to make a f uh, CD drive first bootable media so we need to go to BIOS first so I am in BIOS and go to boot and just make CD ROM drive first and hard drive of course second so click on F10 save configuration changes and exit now yes I want to save changes and here you can see we have our machine has been booted from a Ubuntu installation media so just wait for few minutes it will give you the option it's loading the kernel and required things So we are at the welcome page. So we have two options try Ubuntu or install Ubuntu. Try Ubuntu uses something like y you have directly into Ubuntu and it's like live environment but it's not getting uh, like installed on your hard disk. So I'm going to use the second option which is install Ubuntu because I want to install Ubuntu on my hard disk only. So click on install Ubuntu and click on continue if you want to install third-party software for graphics you have to check these things 
but you have to make sure uh, before doing this you are connected to internet but right now I'm not connected to internet you can see so I have leave that and click on continue so we have option here for like drive partitions so the first option is install Ubuntu alongside Windows 10 and this will what what this will do this will uh, left your uh, Windows 10 operating system in hard disk and use the unallocated space for storing the uh, Ubuntu partition and the swap file as well as so the second option is is this this can install Ubuntu is this this can install Ubuntu will delete your all the partitions from like from your uh, uh, hard disk which is existing created and will give you the option for uh, like for fresh hard disk and we have something else if you click on something else it will show you the partition which is right now on on you can say on hard disk we have two partition you can see NTFS and TFS as free space so I'm going to use the first option which is install Win uh, Ubuntu along with alongside Windows 10 so just wait for a few seconds I have clicked on so here we are install Ubuntu alongside Windows 10 click on install button and yes this will write changes to disk continue and I'm going to select India like I'm from India and we have a keyboard layout and I'm going to select the default one English US and uh, it's asking for name so I'm going to type my name because I'm going to type like two uh, boot and going to type my password for my account and we are done click on continue and you can see detecting file systems so we are almost done it will detect the like uh, hard disk configuration and it will start the installation for Ubuntu on free space of hard disk so just wait for a few seconds So detecting file system is completed and now you can see it's copying the file like installations file operating system file from installation media to hard disk and it will take a few minutes to get the complete copy of copying file from installation media to hard drive. So now copying file is completed and this is installing system. So it's moving step by step. configuring target system
So the installation is completed. You need to restart the computer in order to use the new installation. So I'm going to click on restart now and going to unmount the installation media for my machine. So the machine is rebooted and we have option for Ubuntu and we have option for Windows 10. So I'm oh, I'm going to launch the Ubuntu operating system for now. And it's loading the kernel. booting now so we are at login screen I am going to put my password for my account So the OS is installed and do one thing let's verify the disk partition here. So we have total around 137 GB drive and we have you can see here extended partition uh, 50, uh, 50, uh, 54 GB and we have file system partition of 50 GB and we have swap partition for 4.3 GB so this all about like you can say the installation of dual boot operating system Windows and Ubuntu and thank you for watching please subscribe me for more videos and if you have any query any suggestion related to this or any uh, other video uh, any other video of my channel please let me know on my given mail id thank you once again bye bye